So you think cryptic crosswords are too hard? Well, I challenge anyone who says they can't do cryptics to come with me and have a go at this one. I'll show you step by step how to solve it. When you look at a cryptic clue, it often looks like complete nonsense. But remember, the real meaning is always there somewhere, as well as a more roundabout way of getting to the answer. There are different types of cryptic clues. All you have to do is recognize the key words in the clue. Let's start with one across. Stinging insect, damaged paws, four letters. I put damaged in italics because that's the word that tells you it's an anagram. The answer's got four letters and the only word in the clue that has four letters is paws. Can you see a stinging insect made from these letters? What about wasp? There. That wasn't too hard, was it? You solved your first cryptic clue. Now, instead of moving on to three across, as we've got the first letter, let's try one down. This planet world, I hear, five letters. I hear tells you it's a sound -alike clue, so say the whole clue out loud. This planet world. Listen to what you're saying, because you've just said the answer. We know it starts with W, has five letters, and has something to do with planets. So, we've tackled an anagram and a phonetic, now let's try a hidden clue. Look at six across. Mislaid in Buffalo State, four letters. I've highlighted in, which tells you that the answer is hidden in the clue. We know it starts with L, has four letters, and has something to do with mislaid. Remember the answer's already written in the clue, though it may be the end of one word and the start of another. Have a look at the end of Buffalo and the beginning of State, if you're a bit lost. If you have a look at two down, you'll probably find it a piece of cake. Stop changing the mail. Starts with P, ends with T, and has four letters. The word changing tells us it's an anagram clue. Both stop and mail have four letters, so it's either an anagram of mail, meaning stop, or an anagram of stop, meaning mail. Now, post your answer on the grid. Now, let's look at five across. Bouncer holds a little weight, five letters. The word holds in the clue is another key word to indicate that the answer is being held somewhere in the clue. We know it starts with O, so there are only two possibilities, but only one that has a reference to weight, not to mention the fact that only one is a real word. Now let's look at three down. This is a double meaning clue, the only type of clue that doesn't have a key word to tell you what type of clue it is. However, these clues are usually very short. Mostly two or three words. Simply try to think of a word that means both darling and expensive that fits into our grid. Oh dear, I think you've got it. Moving on to three across now. Sketch a one-all score with four letters. Can you spot a key word in the clue? If you can't, it must be double meaning clue. Something that starts with D, has four letters, and means both sketch and one-all score. Hmm, you'll have to draw on your imagination for this one. Four down. Waltz mentioned a dance, five letters. Mentioned tells you it's a sound -alike clue. You have to try both ends of the clue until one works. If you say a dance aloud, does it sound like waltz somebody? No, it doesn't. So try saying waltz aloud. Sound like a dance to you? You should waltz this one in. Now eight across. Orange food makes automobile decay, six letters. Once again, no key words here, so let's try to think laterally. An automobile decay, a car rot. What's that got to do with orange food? Seven down. For a change, son, I'm the simple man who met a pieman. Five letters. Well, for a change tells you it's an anagram, and the answer has five letters, so... It's probably the letters of Sun I'm. Now, who was the simple guy who met the pieman? You'll have to remember your nursery rhymes for this. Eight down. Teach about swindler. Five letters. Can you spot the key word? About tells us to change the letters about. It's an anagram. Remember, the number of letters of the answer indicates which word in the clue is the anagram word. I don't want you to cheat on this one. Ten across. Some of the Islam use mental entertainment, nine letters. The key words are some of, 
telling us that some of the words in the clue are hiding the answer. It's a hidden clue. Look at the grid to see if you have a first or second letter to help tell you where to look. We already have M as a second letter, so why don't you try all the possible nine-letter combinations for your own amusement? Nine down. B leaves branch for cattle station. Five letters. There's often a reference to an individual letter in cryptic clues, and this is an example. B isn't just a bumbling insect. It can also be the letter B. So, if the letter B leaves branch, how does that relate to a cattle station? Thirteen across. Hens to become truthful. Six letters. What next? We've got lying poultry now. Well, become is the key word here, telling you it's an anagram. Hens too has six letters. So, can you find a word using these letters meaning truthful? It's not hard, honest. Eleven down. Uses axe on cutlets. Five letters. Hmm. Looks like a typical scene in a butcher's shop. No key word here. Maybe it's a double meaning. Can you think of a word that means uses axe and also means cutlets? Hmm. Cuts, cleaves, severs. Come on, think of a word. Chop, chop. Fifteen across. Who's shaken up the display? Four letters. Shaken up are the key words here, implying that one of the four-letter words has been shaken up. Take no notice of punctuation. That apostrophe is there to fool you. Can you show me the answer now? Fourteen down. Wicked to live backwards. Four letters. Now this is a new type of clue, a reverse clue, where a word like backwards, reverse or return is the key word telling you to read the word backwards. Once again, there's only one four-letter word in this clue. Go on, be a devil. Seventeen across. Lisa mistaken to travel by sea. Four letters. The word mistaken is another classic keyword telling you it's an anagram. So, change the letters of the only four-letter word to find a word that means travel by sea. Sixteen across. Interior of dinners. Five letters. Well, the word interior is used twice here. Firstly, to tell you that the answer is in the interior of another word. And secondly, it's the meaning of the answer. We know it starts with I. I told you they were easy. Fifteen down. Type scene in Windsor tie. Four letters. Seen in are the key words telling us that the answer can be seen somewhere in the clue. So, we're looking for a four-letter word starting with S. It's an easy sort of clue, don't you think? Eighteen across. Bound to sound like the tide. Four letters. The words sound like are a dead giveaway. Either bound sounds like a word meaning tied, or tied sounds like a word meaning bound. Any ideas? Twelve down. Prize for a hospital department. Five letters. No obvious keywords here, so try to think of other words that could mean prize or a hospital department. Remember to refer to the grid for letters that you've already filled in. And now you've finished. You've won the award.